Today we are on Free Code Camp, backend development and APIs, and we are in the Managing Packs with NPM course, and we are going to manage NPM dependencies by understanding semantic versioning. Okay, so this is basically telling us that a package version will look like this. So if we look at our actual packages, we can see that it's major, minor, patch. So there's two periods, as in three different sections of the version. So uh, in this example, 4 being the major version, 14 being the minor, and 0 being the patch. So all that's basically telling us here is that semver, or semantic versioning, is like a standard of versioning that uses this format. Um, so the major version will increment when you make incompatible API changes. So if the major changes, it is not compatible with any of the previous. That's what a major change is. When a minor changes, it is backwards compatible. So if, a, if there's a minor update, this will go up by one, and it is backwards compatible with all the versions that match the, uh, that match the major, essentially. Um, the patch is, inc should increment when you make backwards compatible bug fixes. So this is just small little bug fixes, and it will be backwards compatible with all of these versions backwards, right? So going down. Uh, except for major, right? Because that's when it would be a non-backwards compatible change. So it's really just good to note that if this changes, but these are the same, they're still compatible. If both of these are different, but the major is the same, they're still compatible. If the major is different, they're no longer compatible. You'll have to update uh, or downgrade rather depending on what you're trying to do. So all we're going to do in our dependency section of the package JSON file is make free code camp major one, minor two, and patch 13. So if we go back to our replit project here, we are just going to change the free code camp ex example dependency. This would be like express in a real project or uh, mongoose or whatever dependency we're actually using. And we want to change it to one, two, 13. So major of one, minor of two and the patch of 13, so the little bug fix of 13. All right, and all we have to do to get the check mark here is do this as we just did and run it and then take our live link, copy it, go back to our free code camp and paste in our solution. And that's all we had to do for that one. Hope that helped and I hope to see you guys in the next challenge.